Hey guys, I'm Eijin Des, back with another lesson. Today we're going to be talking about telling time in Japanese. I actually made another video, uh, a vlog video on my channel about how time works in Japan. Um, this lesson specifically tells you how in Japanese to state time, hours, minutes, stuff like that. Let's review our numbers really quick. 1 to 10, I'm just going to spin them right out. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5,6,7,8,9,10 Alright, make sure you got those down before you, you know, go through this lesson. Our key sentence. San Francisco wa ima gogo rokujihan desu. Okay. And then our vocabulary, all new words here. Our first word is the word for now. Ima. Ima. Next is AM and PM. Gozen and gogo. Gozen. Gogo. Morning, noon, and night are asa, hiru, yoru. Asa, hiru, yoru. O'clock is just ji. And then half is han. And then our minutes are fun. Fun. Okay? Let's get right into it. Our grammar how to indicate an hour of time. You just Take a number and you add G. Number and G. A G A o'clock. For example, one o'clock, ichi ji. Ichi ji, ichi ji. Twelve o'clock, juni ji. Juni ji. Okay? Pretty simple. There are a few exceptions. Okay, four o'clock is not yonji or shiji, it's just yoji. Yoji, yoji des. It's four o'clock. Seven o'clock is shichi ji. Never nanaji. And then nine is kuji. Never kuji. Okay? Watch out for those exceptions. Activity one. We're going to write the time on each clock. Shown. Try it by yourself. I'm going to solve it right now. Number one. Um, if you can, I hope you can tell time. <laughs> this is obviously one, two, three o'clock. Three o'clock. So three is sang and o'clock is ji. This is Sanji, Sanji. Okay, number two, one o'clock, one o'clock, Ichiji. All right, number three, seven o'clock, Shichiji, Shichiji, Nanaji Janai, not Nanaji, Shichiji. Uh, number four is nine o'clock, Kuji, Kuji, not Kuji, but Kuji. You can see I'm throwing out the exceptions there. Okay, this one is another exception. Four o'clock, yoji. Yoji. This one here, 11 o'clock, is ju ichiji. Ju ichiji. Seven, number seven is uh, 12 o'clock. Could be noon, could be midnight. 12 o'clock, ju niji. Ju niji. Ju niji. Number eight, our last one is eight o'clock. Eight is eight o'clock, okay. Uh, hachiji, hachiji. All right, not too hard. Here are the answers in bold. Hachiji. Mm. All right, and then if you want to indicate PM or AM, just add gogo or gozen. And you have to add it before the time. Uh, 1 PM, gogo ichiji. 6 a.m. Gozen, Gokuji. Alright. Again, note Gozen and Gogo always go before the numbered time expression that you want to indicate. Also in Japan, it's very, very common to hear people just say uh, 6 in the morning or, or uh, 2 in the afternoon or 12 at night. And they indicate that by saying Asa, Hiru, and Yoru. So 6 at night would be Yoru, Rokuji. Or six, that's also 6 p.m. Asa, Rokuji is 6 in the morning, 6 a.m. Hiru, Niji, 2 in the afternoon, or 2 p.m. And like Gozen and Gogo, these always come before your numbered time expression. All right, I want to talk a little bit about how time is told in Japan. Japan uses a 12-hour clock system when they write time. When they say time, however, it's usually, normally, a 12-hour system. 
So what you see and what you say sometimes don't match up. So you'll notice here their clock starts at what looks like to be zero o'clock, but they don't say zero ji, they say gozen junichi or yoru junichi, 12 at night. And then one, two, three, etc., 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 all the way up to uh, 12 noon is normal, okay? Those are all in the morning. And then after 12, you don't repeat back to one or whatever, or um, yeah, you don't go back to one. You keep going and it goes to 13 o'clock and 14, 15, 16, all the way to 23 hours. In America, this is called military time, but no one uses this in America. In Japan, this is normal. You see these times everywhere, all the time. And I kind of uh, changed the color down here under what you say. So the more bluer ones are the uh, gozen, a.m. times. And then the more green ones are the gogo, the p.m. times. All right. Now let's do activity two. We're going to use context clues to write uh, what you would say for each time shown. Try it on your own. Pause the video. I'm going to solve it right now. Number one, well, it's daytime. I mean, the sun is out, okay? Uh, and it is six o'clock. So uh, actually, that's kind of hard. Um, it could be six in the morning, depending on what time of year. It could be six p.m., actually. I think I, actually, one through four, I'll use hiru, asa, and yoru. And then five through eight, I'll use gozen and gogo. Let's see how that works. Anyways, number one. Uh, let's just pretend it's 6 in p.m. So I would say, Hiru, Gokuji. Hiru, Gokuji. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah. Number two, the moon is out, sun is set, and it is 2 o'clock. So this is obviously 2 a.m. Uh, yoru, Niji. Yoru, Niji. Number three, moon is out again, and it is 7 o'clock. So... Yoru shichiji. Yoru shichiji. Number four, sun is out and it is 11 right before lunchtime. So uh, we would say uh, asa ju ichiji. Asa ju ichiji. Okay, five through eight, I'm going to use gozen and uh, gogo. So this is what? What would you say? It looks like 14 o'clock. Military people would say 1,400 hours. It's actually 2, 2 p.m. So this would be gogo niji, gogo niji. Okay, number six, this is 9 p.m. Gogo kuji, gogo kuji. Number seven, well, this is just five in the morning, 5 a.m. So we would say gozen. Goji, gozen goji. And number eight, the infamous zero o'clock. Uh, this is midnight. Or, gozen juniji, gozen juniji. And here are the answers. Let's see, number one, I did say hiru, yeah. Okay. More specific time, let's go to, let's start adding minutes to things. Uh, you can add, you can indicate half past or 30 minutes using han. So 5.30 is goji han. 9.30 p.m. gogo kuji han. Gogo kuji han. To add more specific minutes, use this uh, formula. Sorry, that was a little out of order. A G B hun. B hun. Okay, hun is uh, minutes. So 5.12 would be goji juni hun. 5時 12分 9:05 p.m. is 午後 9時 5分 午後 9時 5分 Now there of course as always with any human language there are exceptions uh, pronunciation exceptions and there are quite a few of them when it comes to minutes telling minutes number 1 you'll notice is not 1分 but 1分 1分 2 is as we expect 2分 Three is sampun, sampun. Four, you have an option. You could either say yonhun or yonpun, whatever you prefer. Five minutes is gofun, gofun. 
six, ropun. Rokufun, I guess it's just hard to say. So all the Japanese say ropun, ropun. Seven is either shichifun or nanafun. Okay. Eight, hapun, hapun, or hachifun. Hachifun, hapun. I like hapun better. Number nine, kyufun. Not kuhun, but kyufun. And then any 10 uh, minute is just jupun. Now the textbook that I'm following, based, that I'm basing the order of my videos off of, listed jipun as a possible pronunciation for 10 minutes. Jipun. But I've never actually heard that in practice, and it sounds kind of funny to me. So I'm only going to write jupun, and I will say jupun, and I will always recommend jupun. All right. Activity three, let's use the, uh, our knowledge of Japanese time to write down the times shown here. Pause the video now, try it on your own. I'm gonna solve it right now. Number one is 1400 hours, seven minutes. So that would be, what, 2.07 p.m.? Great. Gogo niji nanafun, or gogo niji shichifun. I like nanafun better. Number two, 9.10 in Japanese, 9.10 a.m. would be Gozen Kuji, Jupun, Jupun. Number three, 12.30 in the morning, Gozen Juniji, Han, Han. You can say San Jupun, but uh, we learned Han, so let's try to use that. When I show the answers, it's going to say Han. Gozen Juniji, Han. Number four is 8.24 in the p.m. Gogo, 8.24 in the p.m. Or 24.00 in the p.m. Number five, 12.32, 12.32, And this is Gogo, uh, right? Gogo, 12.32, Number six, 10.55 in the morning, Gozen, Gozen, 12.00. Mm -hmm. Number seven is six forty one in the PM. Rokuji ah gogo rokuji yonju ippun ippun. All right. Number eight three eighteen in the morning would be gozen sanji ju hapun sanji ju hapun. All right. And here are the answers for you. You could also have used uh, asa, hiru, and yoru, but you know, I just I just use gogo and gozen. You can state the current time at a specific location using this phrase. Uh, location wa ima. Mi ima means now, right? Ima. Time ji des, or some more specific time if you want. So here we have a little map, and uh, we're gonna use that map. With our examples here, it is three o'clock in Japan now. Nihon wa ima sanji desu. Nihon wa ima sanji desu. Okay, it is nine o'clock in Saudi Arabia now. Saudi Arabia wa ima kuji desu. Activity four: Use the map to the right uh, to fill in each blank below. Okay. Number one, I'm gonna solve it right now. Number one, Miami wa ima ji desu. Nani nani ji desu sometimes. So let's look over at our map. Miami, it says 1400 hours, which in American time is just 2 p.m. 2 p.m. So the answer is number one, Miami wa ima gogo ni ji desu. Gogo ni ji desu. Number two, San Francisco. San Francisco, right? San Francisco wa ima nani nani ji desu. And according to our map, it is 11 a.m. So, San Francisco wa ima gozen juichi ji desu. Number three, it's asking for Anchorage, Anchorage, Alaska, right here. Okay. Anchorage wa ima gozen juichi desu. Gozen juichi desu. Number four is Denver, Denver, Colorado, right here. It is noon in Denver on this map. So, Denver wa ima juniji, ah, 
午後十二時です。午後十二時です。ピュアソセイ、ヒル、十二時です。And then number five, finally, ダラス、ダラス、テクサス。ダラスは今、午後一時です。午後一時です。And here is, here are the answers. Okay, we're wrapping up. Let's do listening practice. Activity number five. I'm going to read two、uh, sentences and I want you to write them down either on a piece of paper or in your head, wherever.、Uh, we're going to practice to see how good your listening skills are. All right, here we go. Number one. Shichiji, yonju go fun des. Shichiji, yonju go fun des. Pause the video. If you need more time, I'm going to show the answer. Number one is. Okay. Number two, it's going to get a little harder. Ready? Number two. Miami wa ima hiru niji yon fun des. Miami wa ima hiru niji yon fun des. Okay, pause the video if you need more time. The answer is. Miami wa ima hiru niji yon fun des. It is 2 04 in the afternoon now in Miami. Okay, moving on to activity six translation practice. Translate the following statements into either Japanese or English based on what you're given. Pause the video if you need time. I'm going to show the answers right now. Gozen Roku G is 6 in the morning. 4 10 e PM in Japanese. How would you say that? Yoji Jupun. Yoji Jupun. Google. Yoji Jupun. All right, we come back to our key sentence. San Francisco wa ima gogo roku ji han desu. Which you should now know means in San Francisco right now, it is 6 30 PM. And now for the homework.、Um, throughout your day, the, actually, this homework, the first one is titled wrong. I forgot to change the title. But,、um, anyways, throughout your day,、uh, whenever you read the time, just try reading in Japanese in addition to English. Simple as that. There's also a worksheet for this lesson. Go to my、uh, website, there's a link in the description below. You can download it for free. The answers are also there for free. Check it out, check it out. Practice your Japanese. Otherwise, that's it for today's lesson, guys. Thanks for watching, and as always, I'll see you in a future lesson.